you're going to deal with it. And stop fast forwarding. You know who you are. Stop. Okay, that was going. That was going. That was going. Okay, it might get a little messy, people. Hey, we got silverware. I think I get two butter knives. <laughs> you, got, you got butter knife in there? Okay. Yeah. I'll take two butter knives. Just give it two sets. Is it okay if I use my own spoon or no? Don't care, buddy. Okay. Caught my Randy Santel spoon. Alright, buddy. Okay, we're gonna go on one, two, three, or one, two, three, ready or first fight. Right, he tells you go, you hit it. That's all you gotta do. Okay. Okay. One. Two, three, go. Hey guys, what we have here is like four pounds of uncooked pasta. That's how they, they weigh it uh, before it's cooked. But usually after it's cooked, it's at least double. So it's about eight or nine pounds of pasta plus the sauce. Um, plus the meatballs. Um, they're saying it's a one pound meatball, but I'm going to let you know those are probably about a pound and a half at least a piece. So about three pounds of meatball. And then you have about a pound, pound and a half of garlic bread over there as well. Um, you get one hour to finish this. And I didn't even know when I came in here. Just, this was just a challenge around my area that I haven't done yet. So I wanted to do it. But um, you get $100 if you finish this. So... Let's hopefully I finish this. This is like 14 to 16 pounds, and no, I didn't weigh it on the scale, but I'm I know my body. That's what she said. Uh, it's gonna get messy, but I'll clean the table up too, huh? Right, I'll get it all. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
People, I get complaints um, because I blow my nose and I'm at the table. Look, you cannot get up. So I'm telling you now, for the people that can't take it, hey, when you start stuffing all this food in you, some of your liquids in your body is wanting to come out, okay? So um, I have to blow my nose. And can't just throw it on the floor I try to keep it on the side so you guys please if you're squeamish about that please don't even watch the rest of this uh, because uh, I try not to be gross about anything but eating like this is not civil anyway uh, I'm gonna apologize in advance but I'm gonna say I've warned you and I told you so Can we take that flight? Mm -hmm. 
Um, yeah, let me get let me be fair about it. Good? Yep. Okay. Thank you. Gotta mm. get it all. I was just having, <laughs> just having supper. Oh, shoot. I think you can look at this. Uh, uh oh. That don't work, it don't work. Yeah, just just well, it might not even have it might have a black screen because it times out. It, it, it's on. It's on. Is, is it getting everything? Yep. Okay, that's cool. Thank you. There you go. I used to do this since I was a little. I always did this with my spaghetti. Maybe remind me of my childhood. Guys, if you haven't been to Olive Garden stuffed pasta, all you can eat, I recommend it. <laughs> I have a video I just put out. It's very, it, I went to Fairview Heights, Illinois, and uh, but they, uh, man, there was some good pasta. That Z, Zitty Frida stuff, oh, it should be illegal. <laughs> I'm telling you, that stuff is delicious. <laughs> yeah, you get that one, one food somebody has, and it's kind of hard to even try anything else because you know that's good. I, that 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 that, that Zitty Frida stuff, I didn't want to try first because I'm like, man, I don't want to try nothing else. So. Have a seat anywhere on the left hand side, guys. Stay out of splatter. Napkins too, please. Yep. Thank you. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Okay, guys. Snot police. That did not jump out of that napkin and into my bowl or get on anybody in this establishment. It just didn't clobber anybody. Okay, it's inside that napkin. Um, I'm just eating my food, okay? So, uh, you've been warned again. I, I don't know what else to tell you guys. Um, this is not the cleanest sport in the world. Um, I don't know why some people think it is. But, uh, please, please, just be civil with the comments. Um, other than that, after so long, your brain tells you that, hey, this is nasty. Um, this pasta isn't that bad. It is good pasta, but... When you get to this point, your brain is telling you it is no matter what. So um, I hit it hard to begin with, and then I start slacking off, but I hit it really hard to begin with. I wanted to say I hit it really hard. I had to say that a few times. I know people are going to say, hey, that's what she said. But getting this down best I can. Uh, I didn't put any music in this just for the... Not an ASMR effect. Maybe so. You know, some people like it. So every now and then, um, I do different stuff on my videos, okay? And 
You might want to turn your head again because I'm about to hand chew just to get these meatballs. I tried to chop it up with a spoon, um, but it was taking too long. So I just had to get in there with my hands and um, squish it up. Uh, told you so. But I didn't put any music in here because some people comment, hey, why do you got that cheesy music? Why do you got it? So every now and then I'll do something different, okay? So if you guys like the music just for this once, please give me give me some slack. Um, I'm just doing a little bit here and there for everybody. I can't please everybody. I know that, but uh, I switch it up from time to time. Bowl keeps filling up. Be one with the new one. Oh, yes. <laughs> <sighs> Okay. 
Hiccups. That'll help. It happens all the time. I was just waiting for it to kick in later. Uh, later. And if you wonder why I keep my video so long, um, there's a fast forward button on here. I know in the premieres you can't do it. So if you guys like to fast forward, uh, when you see my premiere, just wait an hour and then watch the video and you can fast forward all you want. Um, I leave it in its entirety so people that want to watch the whole video, they can. And the people that don't, then they can fast forward. Um, it can't be the other way around. I can't have it fast forward and if people want to watch the whole thing. Uh, they won't work out so it works out for the best for both people if I just leave them longer and you can just uh, pick and choose what you want to do hey, You got to start off real strong because it's gonna take a while after a minute The garbage disposal it's a little messed up right now but probably say something to them. They'll say, hey, we're here at Dimaggio in the island for garbage disposal. Uh, Cuts it off? Where? Here? At your How about now? Yeah, yeah. Okay, I got you. Sorry about that.
Oh, I'm just sweats. Here's more napkins, please. Yes, sir. No. Okay. If you want to catch any more like a daily events and picks that I do, um, follow me on Facebook under the garbage disposal. Uh, if you see it on my YouTube channel um, on the home page on the right corner of that artwork up top, that big picture. Um, it's right there or just look under the garbage disposal. Follow that, like that, and you will get uh, more updates and see what daily life um, stuff that I'm doing. Hey guys, my name is Joe DiMaggio. I'm the owner of DiMaggio's Pizza and Pasta. We are here with the garbage disposal. He is doing the uh, pasta bowl challenge. It is three pounds of dry weight pasta, two one pound meatballs, and two 20 inch half loaf garlic breads. He's got one hour to eat it. And he's got 34 minutes and 25 seconds left. And he's doing a heck of a job and putting a big debt in it.
All right, guys, he is at his 30 minute mark. So let's give him a round of applause, okay? He's almost finished. Oh, it's gonna be a long, a long finish here. <laughs> I, was full, I was full like 10 minutes ago. <laughs>
Oh, this ain't easy, I'll tell you that. Clean, right? Okay. Let's want to make sure. Yes, sir. Ready for seconds? Uh-uh. Nope.
Congratulations. All right. Oh, thank you guys. Oh, I was full like 20 minutes ago. Oh. Yeah, I'm cheap and I don't want to come back and do that again. Thanks for watching. If you want to watch an Oroko on your TV, please search the garbage disposal and lock that in. Um, I have shirts in. This is unisex shirts. On those, I have a choice of have a great day, Lynch made of the plans, or that's what she said. Have them all the way from small to 5X, excluding 4X. Um, also, I have brand new shirts in of the women's cuts. Uh, the women's cuts only come in have a great day, Lynch made of the plans, but I have them all the way from small to extra large. I also have tank tops in women's already right now, and I have tanks in men's in probably the spring or the summertime. So uh, get with me on my social media, and it's right here on the home page, uh, right here in the top right corner. You can get with me. The best time, best uh, to get with me is my Gmail, and just put T-shirts as the subject title. But any of those, you can probably try to get get with me at. Uh, but subscribe to my page, hit the notification bell to get notified of upcoming events, and live streams, and videos. Uh, please hit the like button for me. And uh, if you could, please share with your family, friends, and even your boss. Have a great day, unless you made other plans. <laughs>